Welcome, cosmic explorers, to Celestial Chronicles, your gateway to the mysteries of the universe and beyond. Today, we're embarking on a thrilling journey into the heart of one of the most groundbreaking scientific endeavors of our time, the CERN Large Hadron Collider, affectionately known as the LHC. The LHC, a testament to human ingenuity and the relentless pursuit of knowledge, stands as a beacon of scientific exploration in our age. Nestled within the heart of Europe, this marvel of modern science is more than just a colossal piece of machinery. It's a key that unlocks the door to understanding the deepest mysteries of the cosmos. This audacious explorer of the subatomic world plunges into the profound enigmas that have captivated and puzzled humanity for centuries. From the infinitesimal particles that make up the fabric of reality to the vast cosmic phenomena that shape the universe, the LHC seeks to answer the questions that have long eluded us. As we delve into the controversial theories surrounding the LHC, we'll grapple with fears of black holes, ponder the possibility of hidden dimensions, and even confront the chilling prospect of a portal to hell. But fear not, for in the pursuit of knowledge, every question brings us one step closer to understanding the intricate tapestry of the universe. So, buckle up, fellow explorers, as we journey into the heart of the LHC, where science pushes the boundaries of the known universe and dares to imagine the unimaginable. Amidst the awe-inspiring scientific achievements, however, a plethora of controversial theories have emerged, stirring the public's imagination and sparking intense debates, concerns and speculations. The LHC, due to its unprecedented scale and the extreme conditions it creates, has given rise to some unsettling fears. The most pervasive of these is the notion that the LHC could inadvertently create black holes. This concern arises from the colossal energies unleashed during particle collisions within the collider, energies so vast they were previously only found in the heart of stars. In addition to this, there are speculations that the LHC might serve as a gateway to other dimensions, or even more disconcertingly, to hell itself. These theories, while largely dismissed by the scientific community, have nonetheless fueled public apprehension and given rise to a myriad of conspiracy theories. These speculations, whether grounded in reality or the product of imaginative extrapolation, highlight the public's fascination with the LHC and its potential implications for our understanding of the universe. Bridging the Divide, Science and Public Perception In the realm of scientific exploration, CERN stands as a beacon of progress, its research underpinned by stringent experimentation and empirical evidence. However, the world of science is not an isolated one, it exists within the broader context of society and public opinion. As such, it is of paramount importance to acknowledge and address the concerns and fears that the public may harbor. The Large Hadron Collider (LHC), with its groundbreaking capabilities, has been the subject of much public fascination and apprehension. While the scientific community is enthralled by the possibilities it presents, the public's perception is often clouded by fears and misconceptions. This dichotomy underscores the need for a bridge between scientific knowledge and public understanding. Building this bridge is no small task. It requires a concerted effort to demystify the complex principles that govern the LHC and its operations. By breaking down these principles into digestible information, we can help dispel the myths and misconceptions that surround this marvel of modern science. Moreover, fostering a dialogue between scientists and the public is crucial. Open discussions can pave the way for a mutual exchange of ideas and concerns, promoting a deeper understanding of the implications of scientific advancements. Such discourse not only enlightens the public but also provides scientists with valuable insights into societal perspectives. In essence, bridging the gap between science and public perception is not just about dispelling fears and misconceptions. It's about fostering trust, promoting understanding, and paving the way for informed discourse. It's about ensuring that as we push the boundaries of our knowledge, we do so hand in hand with society, moving forward together into the uncharted territories of the universe. Exploring the biblical perspective on hell. Hell, a metaphor, a spiritual reality, or both. The concept of hell, a place of eternal punishment for the wicked, has been a subject of intense theological debate for centuries. It's a topic that has intrigued scholars, terrified believers, and puzzled skeptics in equal measure. The interpretations of hell vary widely across different religious traditions, each adding its own unique perspective to this enigmatic concept. In the context of the Bible, hell is often portrayed not as a physical location, but as a metaphorical or spiritual realm. This interpretation sees hell not as a place on a map, but as a state of existence, a realm of suffering and separation from God that transcends our physical reality. This portrayal of hell as a spiritual realm rather than a physical location is deeply rooted in the Bible's teachings.
The Bible uses vivid imagery and metaphors to describe hell, painting a picture of a place of fire and brimstone, of weeping and gnashing of teeth. Yet, these descriptions are often interpreted not as literal depictions of a physical place, but as symbolic representations of the torment and despair that characterize a state of eternal separation from God. However, the interpretation of hell as a spiritual realm does not diminish its significance or the seriousness of its implications. On the contrary, it underscores the gravity of hell's reality and the urgency of the salvation offered through Jesus Christ. The Bible's focus is not on the physical location of hell, but on its reality as a place of eternal punishment and the need for salvation through faith in Jesus Christ. The concept of hell, therefore, serves as a stark reminder of the consequences of sin and the importance of seeking redemption. Whether viewed as a metaphorical depiction of spiritual suffering or a literal place of eternal torment, the message remains the same, hell is a reality to be acknowledged, a fate to be avoided, and a compelling reason to seek the salvation offered through Jesus Christ. Salvation and Redemption, the heart of the biblical narrative. At the very core of the biblical narrative lies the profound concept of salvation and the promise of redemption through Jesus Christ. This theme is not just a peripheral message, but the central tenet that permeates every book, every chapter, and every verse of the Bible. While the Bible paints a vivid picture of hell as a place of judgment and eternal separation from God, it simultaneously offers a message of hope and redemption. This message is not a mere footnote, but a resounding declaration that echoes throughout the biblical text. The concept of salvation in the Bible is multifaceted. It is depicted as a divine rescue mission, a liberation from the chains of sin, and a restoration of the broken relationship between God and humanity. It is the promise that despite the reality of sin and its consequences, there is a way out, a way back to God. This way is through Jesus Christ. The Bible presents Jesus as the embodiment of God's love and mercy, the one who took upon himself the punishment for our sins, offering us a path to redemption. His life, death, and resurrection are portrayed as the ultimate act of self-sacrifice, a testament to the depth of God's love for humanity. But the offer of salvation is not automatic, it requires a response. The Bible emphasizes faith in Jesus Christ as the key to unlocking this gift of salvation. It invites all to believe in Jesus, to accept his offer of salvation, and to enter into a personal relationship with him. In essence, while the Bible does not shy away from discussing the harsh realities of judgment and hell, its primary focus is on the hope of salvation through Jesus Christ. It is a message of redemption, a beacon of hope, and a call to all to embrace the love and mercy offered by God through Jesus Christ. Unveiling the Mysteries, the Profound Significance of Red Heifers In the tapestry of religious symbolism and prophecy, few creatures hold as much significance as the red heifer. This seemingly ordinary animal, distinguished only by its unique color, carries a weight of symbolism that resonates deeply within both Christian and Jewish eschatology. The arrival of red heifers in Israel is not just an event, it's a signal, a sign imbued with profound religious implications. These sacred animals are not merely livestock, they are deeply intertwined with religious traditions, end-time prophecies, and the very concept of purification and divine order. In the ancient rituals of Judaism, the red heifer was a central figure in the process of ritual purification. Its ashes were used in a ceremonial cleansing rite, symbolizing the removal of impurity and the restoration of spiritual cleanliness. This ritual was not just about physical cleanliness, but a symbolic representation of the removal of sin and the restoration of a right relationship with God. But the significance of the red heifer extends beyond its role in ancient rituals. In the realm of prophecy, the red heifer takes on an even more profound role. The birth of a red heifer in Israel is seen by some as a sign of the end times, a herald of the coming of the Messiah. It is believed to signal the imminent construction of the Third Temple in Jerusalem, a key event in both Christian and Jewish eschatology. The red heifer, therefore, stands as a symbol of both the past and the future. It represents the ancient rituals of purification and the prophesied events of the end times. It embodies the continuity of religious tradition, the hope for the future, and the enduring quest for spiritual purity. Third Temple and Eschatological Debates, A Crossroads of Beliefs and Interpretations The idea of reconstructing the Third Temple in Jerusalem stands as a focal point of intense theological debate, a crossroads where differing interpretations of eschatological beliefs converge. This topic is not just a matter of architectural reconstruction. It's a complex web of religious prophecy, historical tradition, and spiritual symbolism. For some, the Third Temple is seen as a prerequisite for the coming of the Messiah, a physical manifestation of prophetic fulfillment. This belief is rooted in certain interpretations of biblical prophecy, 
which suggest that the Messiah's arrival will be heralded by the rebuilding of the temple. In this view, the third temple is not just a building, but a symbol of future redemption and divine intervention. On the other hand, there are those who emphasize the spiritual significance of Jesus Christ's sacrifice as the ultimate redemption. They argue that the physical temple and its associated rituals were fulfilled in Jesus Christ, rendering the need for a physical temple obsolete. In this perspective, the true temple is not a building made of stone, but the body of believers in which the Spirit of God dwells. This divergence in beliefs reflects the complexity of eschatological interpretations. It underscores the multifaceted nature of religious prophecy and the diverse ways in which it can be understood. The debate over the Third Temple thus serves as a microcosm of broader theological discussions, encapsulating the tension between literal and symbolic interpretations, between physical manifestations of faith and spiritual understandings of divine truth. In the end, whether one anticipates the construction of a physical Third Temple or sees its fulfillment in the spiritual realm, the underlying theme remains the same, a longing for redemption, a yearning for the divine, and a hope for the fulfillment of God's promises. Conclusion, Navigating the Intricate Interplay of Science and Faith As we draw this exploration to a close, we find ourselves standing at the crossroads of science, religion, and prophecy. This intersection presents a rich tapestry of complex narratives, diverse interpretations, and profound insights that challenge our understanding and ignite our curiosity. Our journey has taken us deep into the enigmatic world of the CERN Large Hadron Collider, a marvel of modern science that pushes the boundaries of human knowledge. We've grappled with the fears and speculations it evokes, from the creation of black holes to the opening of portals to other dimensions or even hell. Yet, amidst the apprehension, we've also glimpsed the relentless pursuit of understanding that drives scientific exploration. Parallel to our scientific expedition, we've ventured into the realm of the spiritual, exploring biblical perspectives on hell. We've contemplated its depiction as a spiritual realm of eternal punishment, a stark contrast to the physical realities we're accustomed to. This exploration has challenged us to consider the metaphysical aspects of existence and the profound implications of spiritual beliefs. Our journey didn't stop there. We delved into the world of religious symbolism and prophecy, unraveling the significance of red heifers in end-time prophecies. This exploration offered us a glimpse into the intricate interplay of religious traditions, eschatological beliefs, and the enduring quest for spiritual purity and divine order. In conclusion, our journey through the realms of science, religion, and prophecy has been a voyage of discovery and contemplation. It has challenged us to navigate the intricate interplay of empirical evidence and spiritual belief, of observable phenomena and metaphysical realities. As we continue this journey, let us remember that the pursuit of knowledge, whether scientific or spiritual, is a testament to our shared desire to understand the world around us and our place within it. So, there you have it, a whirlwind tour of scientific theories, biblical interpretations, and red cows. Who knew learning could be this fun? Stay tuned to Celestial Chronicles for more exciting journeys into the unknown. Until next time, keep looking up.